Yo, what's up YouTube? It's Monday and some more work on this thing. First, I'm going to take the blades off uh, so they're not in the way. Beauty! Sweet! Just noticed something wasn't right, but you can see that nut shouldn't be moving. That might be a problem if that wants to start coming loose. It feels too tight at that point for some reason. going to make a few adjustments. It feels pretty good but not as good as yesterday. Strange, that feels fine now I've undone that. To there. Perfect. How easy it is to turn. That is the make or break of the whole thing. And this, he said. Yeah, that feels good. I've got this little me bolt mechanism here so that we can elevate the angle. That's a bit more uh, obvious, that is the hyper-aggressive position. And obviously you would need a nut here to stop it flipping over. I've even thought of having a spring on here. Obviously I won't have it this high. I have a spring on here so it can go up a bit if it wanted to. That motor does look cool with that chain, doesn't it? <laughs> Do you reckon? Just a quick reminder. Uh, one of these is welded on very badly and can't be used and that one I've no idea why I welded that on that was some stupid idea I had at the start of the project but we can use either this one or this one That's pretty much all the gas I've got for today. Uh, these blocks are only so I don't have to remove this. So, yeah, get a bit of wind, don't you think? Be surprised.
surprised if we carried on spinning, but you never know. Oops! Now, if you think that's unusual or not, very beautiful, but a bit strange as well. English countryside. Sweet! Greetings YouTube, it's Tuesday and in this video I shall be doing more work on the experimental wind turbine which will be launching very soon. I get it connected to an amp meter but please remember at the minute it's still not on the tower. Thank you. Right, the battery is saying 10 volts. See there? So what I'm going to do is I'm going to wait for the gas and I'm going to give it a spin and the meter should record how much it's made. Please note this is not any kind of real world test because the thing isn't on the tower. So like I say, the meter will record what it's made. If it makes, no, it's not hit 10 volts yet. Here comes the gust. Go on, baby! Just notice one of the flat, one of the wires is disconnected. Right, here comes the gust, let's try again. the rectifier. Right, the wind's completely died down, as it would. We shall wait for a gust and then we'll have another go. Now everything's plugged in correctly. Just a quick reminder, the meter's on zero. Oh, feels a bit like a bit of gustiness. Oh, feels a bit like a bit of gustiness. Well, it's not reporting any power, which is very annoying. Now it's back at its normal angle, which is poking up about five degrees. Right, it's a bit bright, but you should be able to see what it says. Let's give it another go. You should hopefully be able to see that one meter. Again. 0.1 watt hour. Woo! Let's try again, see if it gets going. So we are getting up to 12. Oh, there it goes. And it's a quick burst. It's definitely making something. Not a lot. <laughs> that looks well funny. Whoa, I do not want to get whacked by that thing. She is a beauty, my friends. She is a beauty. Like it or not, she is a beauty.
0.41 hours. It's saying 0.1 amp peak, but I thought I saw more than that. We're not going to be setting any records, let's be honest. Oh, I've noticed the blades aren't offset correctly, so I'm going to change that. Hang on. Right, I only just realised the blades were in the suboptimal staggering position, which you can see now has been uh, fortified. Let's have another go, shall we? Oh, shit. That was braked by the rectifier then. Awesome, we know that works. Come on, you beauty. You want to see that motor spinning round? Look at it, she's a beauty. There's a little gust, my friends. Come on, the gusts. Come on, you beauties. One more try. Rick Van Winkle. There. Let's go. and get on the meter before the gust dies without getting my head cut off. Ah, difficult. As the electric bike wind turbine is nearing completion, this thing needs to be removed, which I'm not looking forward to, but that realistically has to be the next job. 